After a few months of daily driving my 2017 Volkswagen Golf GTI, I've noticed that this car has a bunch of cool and unusual features that I like to highlight in this video. So without further ado, here are five cool and unusual features of the 2017 Volkswagen Golf GTI. Upon first glance of this car, many people will probably be confused where the trunk release is. After all, this is a hatchback, but Volkswagen cleverly implemented it right underneath the VW logo. Another thing that they cleverly implemented underneath the VW logo is the rear view camera because starting in 2018, the federal government mandates all cars to have a rear view camera. Now Volkswagen didn't want to have an ugly bump right here like some manufacturers that I shall not mention, <coughs> Mitsubishi. So they implemented it underneath the VW logo just like they did with the trunk release. Now this is really cool because right when you put it in reverse, this thing pops up, you can hear a little sound in the front cabin and then you can see a pretty high High resolution image of what's behind you. Most hot hatches have some sort of sport button, but this one takes it to a completely different level with customizable driving mode. This is often found in higher end sports cars, higher end performance cars like the Audi A3 I reviewed last year. Um, but this allows you to customize the steering weight, the drive system, which includes acceleration and suspension, and even the exhaust note. Say, so how about that? An adaptable exhaust note in a $25,000 car and adaptable steering in a $25,000 car. Um, this really is a cool feature and useful when you're driving on the back roads or when you're driving on the track. The third cool feature is the performance information in the infotainment system. Now this is a hidden Easter egg, but it's really, really cool. There's also a lap timer in the center screen in the middle of the gauge cluster, but that is not as cool as this. Now this one has a horsepower meter, a boost meter, and even a G meter. Now you tell me what $25,000 car has performance meters that come in 200 plus thousand dollar cars hidden in their infotainment screens. The fourth cool feature is the hill hold assist, which essentially only applies to the manual transmission cars. Now this happens when you depress the brake fully, the car will hold itself on a hill for a few seconds so you can make a perfect hill start. It'll give you enough time to engage the clutch and drive off without rolling into the car behind you. Now this is a really useful feature when you're starting to drive stick shift, but once you get better at it, you'll master hill starts and you won't need to use the hill hold assist anymore but it's nice to know that it's there. The fifth cool feature is the VW CarNet app. Now this is kind of the same concept as Chevy's OnStar. Um, it's a paid subscription, $200 a year, but Volkswagen gives you six months free when you buy one of their cars. Now this is pretty useful when you're locked out or uh, when you forgot your key somewhere. You can lock and unlock your car from your phone. You could check the fuel status. You could check the location. Uh, you could check the vehicle health status. This is also useful if you're renting or loaning your car to people. Um, but I don't know if it's worth the $200 a year premium. Well guys, that's gonna do it for today. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please be sure to smash that like button and subscribe to the channel for new weekly automotive reviews, news, and how to's that you can use. Also, don't forget to follow us on Instagram for news, updates, exclusive content, and giveaway notifications. I'll see you all in the next video. Peace out.